Well, first of all, thank you for donating your time today. Of course. Can you tell me a little bit about why you wanted to get involved? Um, sure. You know, when I was first approached, I thought, I love to do things with charity, let me think. And then when I really got the pieces and read through them, I was surprised at how impacted I was by every single one of them because they are there's pieces of all of them that you either related to me personally or people I knew, family members or other friends and it was just such a beautiful expression of like what it means to be a woman as a whole and not just the good parts of it. Everything. The funny, the sad, the difficult and yeah, so I was excited to be a part of that and then to see the other people who joined on to like work with such amazing women was exciting. And you did have a range of pieces. You had a very serious piece, comedic. Like, can you talk about why you chose what you chose? Um, you know, I actually, they just gave them to me, which I thought was really interesting, specifically um, the next night, because that piece, well, it's not something that's happened to me personally. I have someone in my family who has touched very close to home. And so when I read it the first time, I was like, Phew. Why did I get this one? And then I was like, you know what? I got this one for a reason, and I feel like I can, I know it, and I can really, I, it's something I really do want to share with people. So it's cool. And was there any piece while you heard the other women read that hit you more personally than you were expecting? Oh, there's so many. I mean, the Cinderella one, I think, hit all of us. <laughs> it was hilarious because you're like, yeah, that's right, Prince Charming. Where the hell are you? But, um,. I think so many of them. And just like that, the overall message of this need to be what you think you're supposed to be or um, not really fitting in. Like there was the one about getting boobs early and being kind of shorter and not being thin. Like that was me. I mean, these puppies came in when I was in fourth grade and I was like, really? I don't want a bra. I don't need a bra. I want to be a tomboy. I thought I was going to be Michael Jordan. Like, come on. And so I definitely had that feeling and I still do sometimes. You know, I'm like, just please. But, um, but it's, then that idea of like embracing who you are and yeah. stuff. And it was in every piece, so it's great. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Thank you so much for having me.